I am Ajit Dama. I'm the principal of Fire Within. Fire Within has a very interesting story. We got our company started in 2006. We have been building mobile wood fire oven trailers for the last 12 plus years. We have close to 1,000 in all 50 states and in overseas. We have ovens in China, in UK, Middle East, and in Brussels. Also, we are educators. We have been uh, conducting Wood Fired University over the last 10 plus years. We just got done 43rd advanced Wood Fired University. Uh, we take a lot of pride in that. This is where we give the essential skills for any individual um, how to run and build a successful mobile Wood Fired Catering Enterprise. So the promise of the Wood Fired University is you arrive here on a, on a Friday, we have a meet and greet, and then we take you through two and a half days of pretty intense uh, hands-on and classroom experience. Um, at the end, the graduation is actual, you are going to run the event. You're going to set up to tear down, it's your show, and we have instructed you to confidently do that. So the promise is when you get back to your hometown, you're ready to run your first event. Um, over the last 12 plus years, we have seen our owners from all walks of life, teachers, fishermen, lawyers, and doctors, engineers. Oftentimes, what fire within our owner looking for is their encore. They want to be with family. They want to cook with their grandkids and their cousins and feed people, make them happy take it to the church, um, or take it to the synagogue. Um, that's, that's the story of Fire Within. So we have oven owners who started out 10 years ago, started out with one oven. Now they have two, three ovens. About 25% of them step into a brick and mortar. So we have success stories all over the country. Another aspect of Fire Within is, again, coming back to the education, we have invested on a complete business manual, business plan, nuts, nuts to bolts, um, A to Z, how to build and run a successful wood-fired mobile, mobile enterprise. That's called rolling in the door. Um, we are never happy with that business plan. We continue to up, update that. We are getting ready to uh, launch our fourth edition. Um, somebody might ask, how did you write it? We, we wrote it uh, because we ourselves were mobile wood fired catering um, business owners at the beginning. And we, we started out with that and now we keep our ears to the ground to all 50 states and getting feedback from our own owners uh, so we know what works, with what doesn't, and also what are the industry trends. Uh, what our people are looking for. So that's how that book is continued to have evolved. Um, final aspect of Fire Within, I would say, is probably the, the, the most important part for us. It is our community. Um, we call it anti-franchise because once you buy a Fire Within oven, you have a lifetime of support. You get invited to a private forum where you collaborate with hundreds of other oven owners. If you have any questions, you post that in there. Then you see um, people from all over the country coming and sharing their experience. Um, so it's a lifetime of support, and I think that's what separates us from any other um, you know, company, because we have those four aspects, and we continue to improve each part of those aspects. We are men of fire. Fire has created who we are. If you see um, the world, almost everything that you see out there, um, that from cars to telephones to cell phones to books to what you wear, is a byproduct of fire. So fire is our story. That's what made us human. So. That's what we try to part in our wood-fired university, 
because when somebody understands the, fi the, the, the power of fire, it gives them a tremendous edge over any other pizzaiola, any other caterer, any other restaurant owner, because you're telling the story of fire. The person who gets it understands what they're bringing in. They're bringing in that primordial theater into somebody's backyard, somebody's wedding event, to a farmer's market. The smell of the wood, crackling of the fire, and using that primordial aspect to produce an incredible pizza that's coming out, or multiple host hosts of other foods that comes out of that oven, is the, is the story that you're bringing in. And time and time again, somebody might ask me, how many other you know, wood-fired uh, ovens in my area? My answer is, don't worry about the competition. It is you and your unique story is what is going to sell, right? Your problem is going to be turning down events. That's typically the story of our, our wood fire oven owners because you just can't be in two places uh, at the same time, right? That's how most of our oven owners grow with one to two trailers and then stepping into a brick and mortar. So understanding the nuances of that fire which separate you from anyone else, right? So when you understand that, you bring that primo product into somebody's event that make that special event and you're a storyteller, um, it demands a premier price, right? It's not uh, the story of you know, somebody coming and telling, hey, Bob or Mary, can you come and just cook 100 pizzas and I'm gonna give you $1,000, right? If you talk to some of our oven owners, they have story after story um, how they market themselves as a premier product, right? You're not only uh, bringing delicious food into their, their event to their loved ones, but there's an there's a incredible story behind it. One of the things we make sure when somebody interested in Fire Within it's every one of our Fire Within consultants' job is to make sure that this is going to provide you what you're looking for. When you look at a photo of a Fire Within Oven owner, or when you see one of our Fire Within Oven owners cooking pizza at a wedding party, or, a, or at a winery, or a brewery, or uh, in a farmer's market, you see the setup, you see the beautiful setup, you see the oven owners having fun, engaging with the customers, and perhaps that oven owner's kids are working behind, or grandkids, right? It looks very romantic. But one of the things that we try to emphasize any of our oven owners, potential oven owners, this is fun, this is incredibly rewarding because you're making incredible food, telling your story and making people happy, right? But at the same time, you have to have a certain mindset. It is work and it's a business at the end of the day. And what I try to emphasize is, I draw a very simple picture. I draw a stick figure with the stick figure holding a balloon, right? That balloon can give you uplifting power, that can lift you, it can give you freedom. A business, that's what, a, ideally that's what a business should be. Give you freedom, give you time to spend with family. As a matter of fact, we have our owners, Bob and Kerry, um, out in Winona, Minnesota. He was a FedEx truck driver went part-time, bought one of our ovens, bought two ovens. Now he is full-time pizzaiola. And winter time, they go to Mexico. That's their lifestyle. We have oven owners who are snowbirds. They're out in Minnesota. They do uh, summer festivals, winter time. They take it to Florida. And business pays for them to travel, right? So, but it is work. So we try to emphasize, have a realistic view of what this is about. So there are a few ways that you can really find out if this is the right business for you. First thing is, order a copy of Rolling in the Dough. And next thing is, come and visit us in Colorado. Come here, let's break bread, make some pizza, get to know the other, you know, 20, you know, other, other uh, couples in the class and ask what they're planning to do. And it's $1,900, right? And, and 
see if that's right because during the two and a half days, we're going to put, through, put you through what you're going to experience in an actual event because that's how you graduate. You actually run the event. Um, that way, you have a realistic perspective of what this is about. When it comes to equipment, we, we take it really seriously because someone is putting faith in us with hard-earned money and, and this is their dream. So when it comes to safety, uh, we take it really seriously. We only use Dexter uh, forward self-adjusting um, torsion axles. We use Goodyear tires, we use PPG paint. Being built in an ISO 9001 facility, being designed by actual mechanical engineers, because this is an automobile. It has a wind number, it may not have an engine, uh, it has a wind number, so this, like in anything else, it has to perform. It has to uh, perform the safety aspect of things. And also we use Fano Bravo ovens in our trailers. That is for one reason, because we actually have a dedicated mold for fire within. And the interlocking design in the oven and the high temperature refactory that we use and it's all built in U.S., right? It's coming back to that Italian um, uh, thinking, right? Use local ingredients. So, so from sourcing to manufacturing, we know exactly what goes into these ovens, right? So if you have to troubleshoot these things, uh, you know, if something goes wrong, we can get to the bottom of it. Uh, early in our stages, we used to import ovens from Italy. And if there's any warranty issue, now you're talking to somebody who doesn't speak English, and they are, you know, seven eight hours on the, you know, ahead of us, all sorts of stuff. So, um, you know, over the last uh, eight nine years, we have been building these ovens, and actual testimonial is actually we have ovens that have been cooking pizza for the last eleven plus years, and and we have cooked millions and millions and millions of pizza in five in ovens, so that's the testimonial. <laughs>